If you live in Cleveland, you don't have to travel far to get top-of-the-line education. Cleveland has more than a dozen institutions of higher learning within an hour's drive. Let's check out the top seven. Hi, my name is Diana. I'm a realtor with Keller Williams Citywide. Welcome to my channel, your home in Cleveland. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click on that subscribe button so you get notifications of upcoming videos. So let's get right into it. This video won't cover all the colleges and universities near Cleveland, but I will highlight seven of them. So first off, Oberlin College. I have to start with my alma mater. Oberlin is located about 30 minutes west of Cleveland, and it ranks number nine as most innovative and number 36 in the U.S. News and World Report's 2021 Best National Liberal Arts Colleges. It also has an amazing conservatory of music. Enrollment is a little under 3,000 and tuition and fees are about 58,000. Two interesting offerings at Oberlin are Winter Term and Exco. For the Winter Term project, students pursue a specific topic either as an individual or as part of a group. And if, if you want to learn the mechanics of a hot air balloon or study surfing in Australia, you can do that. The only limit is your imagination. So you can study all of that through winter term. The other opportunity is the experimental college or we called it EXCO, which allows students to learn non-traditional subjects such as weaving and paper marbling. I think that's where my love of craft started or community organizing, or learning about animal rights. So lots of options there. Number two, Case Western Reserve University is in University Circle, which I discussed in more detail in a previous video linked right at the top there. Case Western Reserve University ranks number 42 in national universities. Tuition and fees are about 53,000 and enrollment about 5,300. It also has top rated graduate programs in medicine, law, biomedical engineering, and nonprofit management. Number three is the College of Wooster, which is located about an hour south of Cleveland, and it ranks number 14 in undergraduate research on creative projects. Enrollment here is under 2,000 and tuition and fees are about 54,000. Number four is Cleveland State University, which is located right by downtown Cleveland. Enrollment is close to 12,000 students here and tuition and fees are about 11,000. About a third of the students are there to earn their graduate degrees in law, engineering, business and urban affairs. Number five, another east side institution is John Carroll University, which ranks number one for best colleges for veterans and number two for regional universities Midwest. It is a Jesuit school located on the east side of Cleveland, as I mentioned, in University Heights. Student enrollment is about 3,000 here and tuition and fees are about 44,000. Students can choose from more than 50 areas of study and John Carroll's most famous alumnus is the late Tim Russell the longest serving moderator of NBC's Meet the Press news program. Number six is Baldwin Wallace University and formerly known as Baldwin Wallace College is located in Berea which is a southwest suburb of Cleveland. It is number 10 in regional universities Midwest. The tuition fees are about 34,000 and enrollment about 3,000. It also has a conservatory of music. Baldwin Wallace is home to the Riemann Schneider Bach Institute, which is one of only five institutions in North or South America to contain manuscripts in the original handwriting of legendary composer Johann Sebastian Bach. Baldwin Wallace University also hosts the annual three-day Bach Festival, which brings renowned musicians and speakers to campus. And that brings me to number seven, which is Ursuline College. Ursuline College is a private Roman Catholic liberal arts college in Pepper Pike, an east side of Cleveland. It is one of the oldest institutions of higher education for women in the United States and the first Catholic women's college in Ohio. It's a small undergrad college with enrollment at about 600 and tuition and fees are about 47,000. So if you're thinking of moving to the Cleveland area, your child has a lot of options for colleges and universities. They can live on campus or near the college. 
And if you live in the Cleveland area, you are nearby in case they get homesick. For a Cleveland relocation guide, check out the description box below. Next, I'd like you to check out this video about why Cleveland is an awesome place to live. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time, hopefully in Cleveland. <music>